Today in a 2013 Nissan Pathfinder, we're going to show you part number HM40975. This is the Pollock 7 and 4 pole trailer connector socket with mounting bracket. This is what the connector looks like when it's installed on the Pathfinder. First off, you got two connection points. This is our 4 pole end. We open it up, we can see we have our 4 pins. One, two, three, four. Now it'll fit any 4 pole connector out there. And what's also a nice touch is that the caps are labeled too, which is ground running lights, left turn and stop, and right turn and stop. We take a look at the seven pole side. It's also labeled two. So good idea if you have a electrical problem, you're not sure which end it is, you can check first. If you're looking for a circuit and you want to check, make sure it's working on a vehicle first, instead of hunting around, you can go ahead and look at the label and go right to it. So let's say we want to look for a running light circuit. Go here, we'll open up our hatch and check it. A few things to know before we do our install, one thing about our connector is it's going to have to use an end like this. This is what you get from the factory tow package. And our new connector will fit with it. Due to the length, we have to install it on this side. And this is the passenger side we're looking at. Remove this plastic rivet. Now this is our bracket we're going to use. And we're going to use a quarter inch bolt, maybe about an inch long, and a regular flat washer for it. Run that through the bottom and through the plastic and through the metal brace behind the plastic. And then another flat washer. And we're using a lock nut. You could also use a lock washer if you like. Okay, so let's go ahead and put this in position. Okay. okay, now let's go ahead and drill a quarter inch hole right here and we'll install some new hardware for that. Now since we're using, since we got a large oval underneath here, we'll use a larger flat washer, in this case a fender washer for a quarter inch bit. And we'll do the same washer over on top because we work with a softer material. And then our lock nut. We'll go ahead and tighten that down. Okay, make this nice and snug. And I'm almost rocking the car with it. All right, let's get our wire harness down and get it ready. I like to add some dielectric grease to these contacts here. We're using part number 11755 from Lubramatic for electrical contact grease. Actually, we do have some excess up here. Let's pull our excess wire. I like to push it through first. Okay. Then we'll go ahead and slide in our connector. Make sure it lines up and push together until it snaps. Now the snap will be very slight. Sometimes you hear it, sometimes you don't. There it goes. All right, let's go ahead and push these two back together. All right, let's go ahead and put a wire up back into place. With that, that'll finish it for part number HM40975, the Pollock seven and four pole trailer connector on our 2013 Nissan Pathfinder. 